Greetings, mortals. I am Cream Dome with a tail style, and today I have two guests with me. Hello, everybody. I'm Cream Dot BG. Hello, I am Tail Star. And today we are playing Legend of. Well, technically it's Tail Star and Cream Dot BD. I'm just here for commentary. They're playing it blind. I'm not. I'm just here for commentary. Huh. And uh, I kind of like fantasy games, so that's why. And Chelsea's playing some shot at too. So uh, uh, let's get this game started. All right. I'll read. This is my first time playing a GameCube Zelda game. Well, this originated from the N64, and I'm going to read. Long have I served as the guardian spirit. I am known as the Deku Tree. The children of the forest, the Kakiri, live here with me. Each Kokiri has his or her own guardian fairy. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. Why does she not have a fairy? I don't know. You guys will see you soon, later on in the game. Yeah, this may have been in a 64 game, but this is my first time playing Zelda on a GameCube. Yeah, sure. That's what I was but I don't for. play. I'm not here with Cream Dog. I don't play much video games at all, anyways. I prefer to read. That's fair. That's a mean face. I believe I've seen that face just be shown in constant self memes. <laughs> Navi, Navi, where art thou? Come hither. Oh, Navi the fairy, listen to my words, the words of the Deku tree. Dost thou sense it? The climate of evil descending upon this realm. Malevolent, malevolent forces that even now are mass mustering to attack our land of Hyrule. For so long, the Kokiri, the source of life, has stood as a barrier, deterring outsiders and maintaining the order of the world. But before this tremendous evil power, even my power is as nothing. It seems the time has come for the boy without a fairy to begin his journey. The youth whose destiny it is to lead Hyrule to the path of justice and truth. Navi, go now. Find our young friend and guide him to me. I do not have much time left. Fly, Navi, fly. The fate of the force, nay, the world, depends upon thee. I have a really bad joke and I'm going to say it. I guess you could say it's... Li you could say... The time has come for Link. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> that was terrible. Yeah, I know, and I said it anyways. And also, why Why did they... Like that kid was humping around. Yeah, he's trying to lift it, but they animated it and, looked at it on, and accidentally made it look like something else. Um, I guess he's no Huh? He was using his body weight to lift it, but... You're supposed to lift with your uh, back, not your hands. Hello? Hello? Yeah. Wake up! <laughs> you... <laughs> the great Dickie Tree wants to talk to you! Get up! Get up! <laughs> hey, come on! Hey, listen! Can Hyrule's destiny really depend on such a lazy boy? Sure, Tailstar. You're lazy. <laughs> what's, what's your partner? The great Dicky Tree asked me to be your partner from now on. Nice to meet you. No. The great ticket tree has summoned you, so let's get going, right? <laughs> that dark type of partner, Chester. I forget Link is a fucking child. His feet didn't even touch the ground when he sat up in bed. <laughs> <laughs> Can I see a trick that speedrun- sh show you guys a trick that speedrunners use when they do this? Well. Because this doesn't damage you, and they use uh, this a lot. Skipping cutscenes? No. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You can't in a Zelda game. 
Unless it's a randomizer. Speeding through. Is that, mm. is that backwards? Yeah. Hold L and then move backwards. Oh, God. And then you left and right allows you to side hop. Mm -hmm. To my house. <laughs> so what I normally like to do is I like to get 50 rup uh, a bunch of rupees. You need at least 40. And there's actually a way to farm it easily. Not like that. You can't lift the grass patches. Here, I'll show you what where the farm. Easy. Let's see. Tail stall. This is my playthrough. Arch power pressure check okay. That's true. Is there an objective? Oh, there is. It's on the map. No, that's not. That's where you oh, enter. that's my house. Yeah, that's where the compass, well, when you get a compass in a dungeon, the red triangle is like where you entered a room in. Gotcha. Can I see though, Tensa? There's an easy way to farm for health. Sure. For... I mean, not health, uh, rupees. rupees. Then you can go into these grasses. The oh, that is grass. Okay. And then it's hard for me to recognize the old game rendering. <laughs> Bossa the Great Mida, Bossa the Kokiri. No, now watch this. We're gonna steal from him. No way. I forget which chest has what. We're stealing from the great boss of the Kokiri. Yeah. What kind of loser keeps a singular rupee in the... <laughs> in a chest? It's like me getting a whole crate no, just I'm to keep our money in Since Quindo said, no, says what, said what to do to farm for rupees, I'm just going to do it myself. BD's about to get rich. <laughs> Tata ba ta ba da ba da is about to get mad money. Uh, do I really need uh, uh, money again? Go, go to the Deku Chi? Or are you asking why we need money again? Uh, we need money for some reason. Oh, it's because you need to get a shield and a, a sword before oh, you can okay. do anything and you need to buy the shield. Is there a shop in this town to do that or? That? I, yeah. I have to assume so, right? Right, Grimdor? Yep, there is a shop. Okay. Does Did the I... Deku Tree tell you that you need a sword and shield? Well, let's find out. Where's the Deku Tree? Uh, the right side of the map, I think. Alright. Yeah, that way. I know you're not used to playing video games, so it's hard to tell. Hey, you, Mr. No Fairy. What's your business with the Great Digger Tree? But I am a fairy, you're not even a real man. Says the one who's literally a child. <laughs> For real. What? You're not a fairy? Say what? The Great Digger Tree actually shoved you? What? What? <laughs> Look at his stupid face. Just punch him. Why right would he shove you and not the Great Biter? This isn't funny. I don't believe it. You aren't even fully equipped yet. How do you think you're going to help the Great Digger Tree without both a sword and shield? There ready. we go. Right, you're right. I don't have my equipment ready. Fun fact about this one line. There's a bunch of controversy. Whether it's Link that said this. Because it's easily... Because it could be Link. Right. But they also don't know if... Uh, my, but they're also debating if Mido said this. Right, it does look like Link says it. However, when Link... it, makes sense, it makes sense that it could also be a Yeah, because when Link, Link says stuff in the game, they don't actually have dialogue lines. They just show him moving, and then. Well, for the most part, but in, <clears throat> but in that. Uh... So Link might have told Mido that he's not equipped either, and then that was Mido's response. However, it could could very well be Mido's response, or it could very well be Link speaking. Also, speedrunners could actually backflip over this dude. Mm. So you can even go into the Great Digger Tree without 
A sword and shield. Let's go get the sword and shield. I kind of need it for the rest of the game anyways. I saw, I saw a rookie up here. Does bitch Navi just spawn in anywhere? She just decides to show up when she wants to. Did you use the D-pad for a quick turn? No, I pressed L. L? Yeah. Oh, gotcha. It locks the camera behind it. I just figured that out. Throw the rock at him. Prank him, John! Where'd he go? Oh! If... Where'd he go? Because to save memory on the... On the... Right. On the game, to make sure there's no lag, if you move a, a certain distance away from something, from an NPC, they disappear. Got it. Shoot him down. Get Dude. The fucker. Dude! That's not your wife! Stop! money to take the shield now. You know what's even funnier? You know what's even... I'll, tell, I'll point out something funny if we get to it, but there, if you were to name Link certain things, there's a lot of funny dialogue. Oh, I know. I For know. example, in one area, I'll point this out, there's a line where it's supposed to say, this is Link. He is under my orders to save Hyrule. But if you name him my homie, this is my homie. He's under... <laughs> yeah. Or there's also a lot of ones where you name Link or Epona a silly name like Fart or something. Or My Ass. <laughs> this is My Ass. He's under. <laughs> or like when Zelda's talking about washing your ass. <laughs> Now, where do we get a sword from? So, uh, I don't... Okay, I try to remember what... Are those what... heart pieces on top of the building? No, those are heart containers. Heart containers? Well, I mean, not heart containers, just, uh... Recovery hearts, right? Yep. Oh, I remember the location. It's crane.bd. It's n northeast. Alright. Northeast, so it's up here. Right, Joshua? Yeah. Well, technically that would be southwest oh. on the map, if up is north and down is south. Because then left is west and right is east. Yeah, I, I kind of don't, I kind of don't pay attention sometimes to that. it backwards. Yep. What does that sign say? Ooh. Oh, just out targeting stuff. We have kind of figured that out. Can I play? Do you do? Yeah, yeah sure. Can I show? Okay. Wrong way, wrong way, wrong way. I know, I'm just exploring. Or Roger getting hit by a rock. Jeez, yeah. Visit the house of the know-it-all brothers to get answers to all your item-related questions. Well, you don't need to do that because you have me. That's true. Attack the chest. He's so short, he has to literally dive in there. You got a dagger. It's the Kokiri sword. It's, for chil it's a sword for children. So basically a dagger. That's kind of cute, though. I like it. So now I can fucking. Oh. You kind of have to equip it, by the way. You can. No, there, that boss screen has four screens. You can literally just. Oh, you equip it from there? Gotcha. <laughs> Got it. 
Take it off. <laughs> I'm saving game at the moment. You don't, that's not the only way. You can, if you don't uh -huh. want to take the time to save the game, you can just press the pause button to, uh, pause. I mean, to, what? Tell me I can't block the boulder? Nope. That's stupid. Also, I wish you I could shouldn't use... talk. You shouldn't talk about yourself like that, Tails, though. I wish I could use C-Stick to uh, turn my camera instead of just left and right on the left stick. You hold L to lock the cap. If you are if you need the camera to face a certain way, you just, in the direction you're facing, you just hold L. Gotcha. You just tap L. And now you can go get to the Deku tree. There's actually a sign that says, do not chop the signs in there. Is there? Yeah, right. I think it's either... Uh, go to the other... I think it's the sign before the maze. That one. I think that's the one that says it. Don't recklessly cut signs. You can't cut those signs. You can only cut the square ones. I have the charged attack. Spin attack. There's a mod of this where you can jump and do ups and didn't do a spin attack in the air like in Smash Bros. Which would lead to massive sequence breaking. I would suggest getting some items from the shop. I believe you have enough for at least one or two. I can tell you which one you might want. Okay, let's check this out. You're gonna want a Deku nut. The nuts. Let's see what else there is. There's no. arrows, but there's no bow yet. Go to the- Deku seeds, those are bullets for slingshot. Deku shield, you, I... I already have one of those. You don't need a stick, just take a nut. Oh, I have 22 on the bottom left. How much was 10? That's 30 rupees. You're gonna- you're gonna get sticks for free, literally in the next two minutes. Right. So you can literally just buy this. I was looking how much the stack of 10 was. It was 30 rupees when I only have 22. Yep. Oh! Hold on, hold on! Can I see? There's a secret in this room. In this shop. Oh. Trying to expect a shopper to find that. I don't know. <laughs> it's kind of a cool hiding spot, though. Her. You don't have enough. I looked. I looked at the five, and I thought, oh, I have enough. But that, then I realized I was five nuts. Yeah. So technically, a Deku nut is worth three rupees. Don't take uh, don't take actual mathematics into game logic, Tails. <laughs> You're looking too deep into that. Which is crazy. That's three units of currency for a tree nut. It's kind of funny that Deku Notes are just fucking stun grenades. What the hell are those things? Uh, I think they're called like ba Deku Babas. You can basically get an infinite supply of these here. I believe the max you can hold is like 10 or 15. Stick. Oh, so you just move in and out to spawn in. I'm assuming that's what it is, but was when you when Cream Dog said that. Oh yeah. What? There! Yeah, I'm sticks do. So they actually do. So okay. Uh, so that jump attack that Cream Dog BD decided to do, um, does twice as much damage as a normal sword slice. However, if you do a stick. Uh, and do a jump slash, it does four times as much damage. Oh, so sticks are just bigger damage. Is it only one hit before it breaks? Uh, I believe it's like one or two. Okay. And they also can be used to light torches. That's cool. There's actually a quick kill. 
Because remember what I said about how like Deku Stick does like four damage? Yeah. There's a there's a thing where you do so basically if you had tag in a here, can I see this screen I'm eating? Alright, sure. So there's a thing you can do while shielding called a crouch stat. So basically, I saw this in the YouTube. Basically, you could do a quick kill on some bosses. If you do a stick, then do a jump slash, then do a crouch stab. You're, the stick? You do, no, so do what you would do. I'm going to test this out when on the boss that you can do this on. Basically, doing this. Jump slash and then crouch stab with the stick? With the sword. With the and, sword. And then your next slice, ne and then your sword will constantly do... The damage that this that this did with the stick. Weird. Is that like a bug or is um, that intended game design? Uh, I don't remember. I believe it would be, with how complicated that would take to do. I believe that could technically be game design. Okay. I believe it's a glitch though. And now for my. Oh, Nobby, Dust has returned. Welcome. Welcome. To hell. <laughs> Listen carefully to what I, the Dekatri, am about to tell thee. In bed. <laughs> Thy slumber these past moons must have been restless and full of nightmares. In bed. How's <laughs> the servants of evil gain strength? A vile climate pervades to those sensitive to it. In bed. <laughs> <laughs> Stop. Barely thou hast felt it. <laughs> In bed. <laughs> <laughs> The time, the time has come to test thy courage. <laughs> oh, so you're not laughing when I... You you tell me to get out when I make a time has come joke, but when he says it, y'all don't even make a comment about it. <laughs> I have been cursed. I need you to break the curse with your wisdom and courage. <laughs> Dost thou have enough... Have courage enough to undertake this task? Mm -mm. Perhaps you do not yet have confidence in your abilities. Return to the Kikiri Forest to learn the skills of combat. When thou art ready, return here and speak with me by using L. Tee <laughs> I just wanted to see what he would say. I have never known that's what he does. I have to go all the way- oh my gosh, I did. To his penis. No power yet, because he's just a little boy. Navi the fairy, thou must aid. But <laughs> and when Navi speaks, use that to listen well to her words of wisdom. Inside the tree. Did the Decker tree just do vor? <laughs> Bad tails though, you wasted a you wasted a nut. Don't use your sword sticks anymore. You need those. Right. You should All be able to, is to put away. Got it. Or you could just put it away quick. No, 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 you're about to die! Uh -huh. Go to the grass patches, bro. Grass are dirt. Cut them! They grow back, don't Where? worry. Now I was mixing in my buttons for a second, that's why. What? The grass patches would probably have grown back by now. Oh, they were. Oh, it's up on the C stick. Oh, that's so confusing. The C stick versus the D pad. You can also use those three buttons with only Y, X, and Z. Oh wow, that's weird. The grass Wait, patches so are there is... if you want to get it. What did Navi have to say about this? You'll you'll see it soon. Just go get your get more. Uh, health from the grass patches that you saw oh, and then go there. up the vine okay now why the hell is 
You know what? Screw it. Just go up the vine. That's what I was thinking. That's a ladder, not a vine. Where the hell's the vine? Oh, okay. I see. Maybe you can climb on it. Took it to Becca Zigata. In bed. <laughs> you can't lift those up yet. That's silly. You will be able to soon, though. That's good. You don't need that treasure chest. Ignore it. Why not? Because it has something you don't need because you have me here. Truck right under where just a fresh off grade, bro. I have the same bag. A bussy. <laughs> oh, it's a map. Can I show you how Yeah, your turn. I'm gonna, the spider shit I'm gonna the map the button to something else. Yeah, please, because I'm gonna like accidentally try and turn the camera left and right and throw shit. So you can use the. Use the. So for this setup that Cream.BD has, X can. If you press X, you'll be able to use the Dicky nuts, and if you press Z, you'll be able to use the sticks. sticks. Okay, because previously it was. Uh, no, oh, no! The C stick buttons. The C stick movements does those buttons as well. Previously it was R to do. Uh... There was no R for anything. Y yeah. R is the shield, but Maybe yeah. Maybe it was X. I don't so, know. So for the C stick, you like you can use C stick to use these items. Right. But you can also use the buttons I just listed, which is X, Y, and Z. Mm -hmm. Oh, Z. That's what I was thinking of. Ah! 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 Sorry. I was... What do I do? What do I do? Uh, uh, uh nuts. Throw your nuts at it. That no. did nothing. Uh, shield? Okay. Come here, you fool. Get the fucker. Ow, 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 forgive me, master. If I give you a clue, will you let me go? When you jump off a high cliff, if you hold that forward, you will hold, roll on the ground when you land and won't get hurt from the fall. I can't guarantee it will work, though. If the cliff is really, really high, well, try it if you are bold. So they changed what, what height hurts you. In the 3DS version. Yeah. Basically in the 3DS. So basically there's like a one cliff. That one cliff that you could jump off of. In this version of the game. You could literally jump off of a certain part of the cliff. And land. And roll. And not take any damage. But in the 3DS version they got that same cliff. And made it where you take damage if you jump off. Because is it a big cliff? Yeah but it was the same size cliff. Mm. They changed the... I know they changed it because of logic, but... That is not an excuse. Oh, what's in here? I wanted to fix something that Grandpa's gonna get pissed that we got it from. You got the slingshot! Heck yeah. So, Crank.BD, use your archery skills, because pretty much that's pretty much how you really use this slingshot. Alright! I personally like to map the, like, buttons like the, uh, slingshot. I prefer to map to Y or X to make it more comfortable to use. Okay. I mean, in my brain, slingshot would be Z, but... But Z, like, on the GameCube controller just feels so weird to have to press multiple times in a row. That's fair. For an arrow or a slingshot. X makes more sense, then. I prefer Y. Or Y, yeah, it, it fits more out of the way. So, I'm assuming we can go up this rush. I'm gonna shoot this. Shoot him dead. I forgot the slingshot is in first person. I mean, you can manually aim, but can't you also just, like, press the button and auto-shoot with targeting? Yeah, you can, but for things- but sometimes you can't target if the enemy is too far away. Right. First, I'd like to show off skills and not use the target. <laughs> right. Oh, I'm gonna kill it, Tosh. Kill it with fire. Oh, look, look at this. The camera's looking down at that web. Yeah. 
<laughs> oh, do we need to jump down to it then? I think so. I mean, that makes sense. Turn around and move! And hold forward. Lucky there was water. What the fuck is that? It's an art, Baba. So, uh, guys, we agreed to do this 100% our father, um, I guess, yeah. Yeah, okay, then As in, like, side quests and stuff, or just playing through the game all the way? Pretty much everything, getting 100% of the items. Oh, wow. And yeah, upgrades. that would be interesting. Oh, that's father, man. Then shoot that. I mean, it'll prolong the, the roleplay, or the playthrough. Yeah, yeah, I don't care. I've only 100% in this game bef once. Ah. Uh, the golds? Sculpture? Sculpture. Sculpture. Oh, there's another one. About 100. A hundred sculptures? Gold sculptures. Well, yes. Oh, and Grandpa said you can light torches. There's a chest right there. I was gonna say, won't the torch get wet? Oh, there's a place where you can just walk. Mm -hmm. What's in the chest? I should also clarify that 100% items is getting all 100 in this game because in every Zelda game it's different. Like there's different like qualifications on what. Mm -hmm. In this game, it's getting pretty much every single major upgrade for like arrows, tunics, side quests, and stuff. All 100 gold sculptures and all the upgrades for like bigger spawn bag and stuff. Gotcha. So not every single chest will count. Will technically count as 100%. Is this a game where you can go back and play after beating the story, or does it is it just over once you beat the story? You can come, you can basically return to this anytime you want. Oh, and then free play. Okay, cool. Well, it's not just free play. It's not like how in like uh, Lego games or once you beat the game, like pretty much one hundred percent of everything is open to you. It's basically like no matter what you do, like you can uh, like. It's pretty much like a Metroid. You just start out where you go, because I know. Okay, so before we finish the game, we can go back and collect gold sculptures. Yeah, but even if we do finish the game, we can just always go back to the safe, the save file, the save, save file that we're playing on right now. We can, no matter what, okay, get so, you can so even if we, even if we did get one hundred percent, we can literally just go back to this save file to well, just fight enemies. I for wasn't fun. referring to one hundred percent. I was referring to completing the story. I know, but I'm just so, saying, yes, even if we, I, I mean, hell, if we even did complete the story, we could always return to the save file to just fool around. We could just gotcha. fight enemies for that's, fun if we that's wanted. That's what I was asking earlier. <laughs> Oh, I thought I, I, I thought I missed. Mm. Please forgive me, Master. I'll never do it again. If you spare me, I'll teach you something cool. You will never beat my brothers up ahead unless you punish them in the proper order. The order is two, three, one. Twenty-three is number one. I think the twenty-three is number one is because twenty-three is a prime number, and a prime number, you know, is you can't divide. Uh, no, it's a number that can only be divided by itself in one. Yeah. Maybe. Oh, oh! Cream up, Edie. I mean the control. I have a way to break... You're supposed to do so solve a puzzle here, but there's a way to skip it. Okay. Is that not what you're supposed to do? Nope, you're supposed to go in the water to push that button. Oh, that's silly. But you can just skip it. That's fair. I know, Navi! I hate this fairy. I hate this fairy. Yeah. The entire Zelda community hates this fairy. She is kind of annoying. <laughs> Oh, 
I'm getting this rupee for you guys. Thank you. You're welcome. I want to know how he's doing this because there's literally like no visible bar handlebars on this. Yeah. Here, you just like the. Don't ignore the enemies, just like the torches. Also, once you're done lighting the torches, put away the stick by like pressing the B really quick. Right. Because if it's on fire for too long, it'll just you'll lose it. I can't wait to test and see if the quick kill that I was talking about for this boss uh, works. Congratulations, you played yourself. Sorry, I keep wanting to press A to attack. Nuts. Oh, you press A to open I was gonna say this all nut on him. <laughs> oh, got it. Not on him. Sorry, I'm figuring out the the keybinds. That it? Crabbo? You know that you're gonna probably check that out of context, right? Take what out of context? Curse God, not on him! Also, Tails like you're gonna have to... Tails like there's a torch. Light that spider web on fire. Oh, the torch is lit. Okay. Oh. Hello? I like the roll so it gets done faster. Not that one, the other one, but the other, the other one you can't access right now. I didn't know if you could roll while having a torch lit. Good job, you were way too slow. Hush, it's my first time playing the game. My first time playing the game, I was even faster than that. Well, that makes sense, Kribble. You have super speed and super reflexes. That doesn't help that this controls like a tank. It's a N64 game. What do you expect? Exactly. Smash Bros. on the 64 runs really sh is really sh is shit on on emulator. Basically, playing on playing Smash Bros. on the N64, but also on emulator, is like shit. Anyways, there's a block that you need to push. Why aren't you attacking? Like, slap. So I there, don't know. there's a no, no, no! Don't rock off. You're gonna have to circle back all the way. Push oh. that block down, and then when you're done, just get the torch that's on the other side and jump. No, 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 no! Push it I'm all the way down. on it. Do I have to hold the grab button? Yep. Okay. The marking is harder than it is, Charles. Oh. I'm work. I'm figuring it out. Listen, it's my first time playing. That is mine too. Yeah. So I'm you're gonna have to get the torch from down there. Gotcha. And don't be slow. I'm supposed to what? Just jump across? Yeah, basically. That's not what I wanted to do. Where am I bringing the torch to? The web. When you get to the webs, roll. Which? Oh, that the web right there? No, that one. The one. In... That's what I'm talking about. In the middle of the floor, right there. Yeah. What you do is you get to the other side, then roll while the stick is on fire. Okay. Uh, am I able to jump back across here? I am. Okay. That's what I needed to know. Whoa. Oh. You can climb back up. Or just put away the sword. I'm doing that. I didn't want this stick to burn. Because apparently sticks are so incredibly valuable. For puzzles like this during while you're child, Link, yes. Oh, there's hearts. Dive, run, dive so you can get the heart. 
Want me to do this since I'm doing- I'm wanting to quick kill the final boss. I mean the first boss anyways. Uh, yeah, go for it. Two, three, one. Oh, I guess from left to right, yeah. Yeah, so basically it's two, three, one. Yeah, I didn't. How didn't you know my secret? How irritating. It's so annoying that I'm going to reveal the secret of Queen Goma to you. In order to administer the coup de grace to Queen Goma, strike with your sword while she's stunned. Oh, Queenie. Sorry about that. Damn, those are little pests. Oh, fun fact, Queen Goma, I believe, has been around since in the Zelda series since the very first Zelda game. Mm. So let's see what the... So the quick kill would be the jump slash with the stick, crouch stab, stab crouch stab with the sword, and then just sword... Slash. The, and just slash with the sword. Basic attack, yeah. Let's start. And she's supposed to die in two hits afterwards. Mm. Oh, this boss. It's, I believe this has been around since the very first Zelda game on the NES. Mm -hmm. Oh, you missed. I don't know. I haven't practiced this much, so this is like... Well, I... Fuck it. I can't get it to work. But at least I did. But I did believe she's gonna die in one more hit. As it to be ED. I got it still. I don't got it because she's now laying eggs. practice this on my own time. Fun fact, in the Zelda 3D re on the, the remake on the 3DS allows you to refight these bosses. Mm -hmm. How do you do the jump slash with your sword? Do you just push forward while you strike? No, you, you lock, block? You, you hold L or just lock onto an enemy. Gotcha. Check our work right now. Yeah, fine. Well done! Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. <laughs> and for those who are wondering why we have that name, it's supposed to be short for Tails Doll, Cream Doll, and Cream Not BD. Yeah. Thou hast verily demonstrated thy courage. I knew that thou wouldst be able to carry out my wishes. Now, I have yet more to tell ye. Wouldst thou listen? Now, listen carefully. A wicked man of the desert cast his dreadful curse upon me. A penis. I mean, yeah, you're kind of right. Enormous balls. I mean, you're kind of right. Ganondorf is a dick. <laughs> <laughs> this evil man ceaselessly uses his vile sorcerer's powers in his search for the sacred realm that is connected to Hyrule. For it is in that sacred realm that our one will find the divine relic, the Triforce, which contains the essence of the gods. Before time began, before spirits and life existed, three golden goddesses descended upon the chaos that was Hyrule. Din, the goddess of power. Nehru, the goddess of wisdom. Farore, the goddess of courage. Wow.
did. With her strong flaming arm, she cultivated the land and created the red earth. Nehru poured her wisdom onto the earth and gave the spirit of law to the world. Her father was shaped in this. Ferrari, with her rich soul, produced all life forms who would uphold the law. The three great goddesses, their labors completed, departed for the heavens. And three golden sacred triangles remain at the point of their... Since then, the sacred treasures have become the base of our... I can't even read this fast anymore. Skrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
<laughs> I always knew you were different from us. You're gay. <laughs> <laughs> I want you to have this ocarina. It looks like a dildo. <laughs> Why is it pink? <laughs> Why did you have to say that to <laughs> This is more supposed to be a white color, but Here, this is a vibrator. <laughs> this is supposed to be a white color, but because of the Ed sixty four graphics, you get that. Right. <laughs> Why did you have to show that so <laughs> Actually, now in Link's hands, it looks like it's supposed to be wooden. Picture it just shirt supposed to take much like medieval times. I wouldn't. Argue with that logic. Right. And it's base and it's basically my ocarina, but not but instead of white, my ocarina is blue. Mm. Oh, and we are gonna have another meme character show up. So the community also hates this dude. Mm. There's so many memes about it. This is me when an awkward when a conversation gets awkward. <laughs> the way he took a little back step first before darting off. <laughs> That's basically anyone when they're in an awkward conversation and they just need a way out of it. Yeah. I mean, considering he's also ten, he doesn't know how to handle. No, he's yeah, he's ten, so he doesn't know how to handle. Awkward conversation, so that's his first response. Right. Oh, I see. Hoot hoot! Look up here! Big motherfucker. It appears that the time has finally come for you to start your adventure. Where's all the time puns? You will encounter many hardships ahead. That is your fate. Don't feel discouraged, even during the toughest times. Go straight this way and you'll see Hyrule Castle. You will meet a princess there. In bed. <laughs> if you are lost and don't know where you're, which way to go, look at the map. The areas you have explored will be shown on the map. Press start to enter the subscreens and L and R to look at the map. I don't care! I do not care! And this... This is why people hate this ca character, because they flipped the yes or no, just other, uh, so sometimes they're gonna accidentally press no, and then have to go, go through the whole thing again. Oh jeez, yeah. I can say right, people, but I hate this character. Right. And what's even funnier is that the next time they want yes and the no, swap, uh, swap again. That's funny. I pressed that! Oh my goodness. But the thing is, that in this version, you can skip all the dialogue by pressing B. Yeah. On the 3DS version, you can't. Yeah. So you have to go all the way to that again. Hoot, 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 hoot! I think he's trying to tell us we need to go to Hooters. <laughs> <laughs> Into a tree, it kind of rippy. <laughs> oh. You want to get to the bridge before day before it becomes night. Yeah. Because otherwise the drawbridge is gonna go. Oh shit! I think it's almost going to be night. Hurry up, fucking Link! Hurry up! Oh, I made it. <laughs> I was wondering what would happen if I dropped. Mm. If I just stood up and dropped it. Right. Oh, you could get a piece of heart here because now it's night. Oh, really? See that dog right there? Mm -hmm. Remember Dash? Yeah, return it to its owner. 
Or how do I trigger? You touched it, so it's not gonna follow you. Where do I trigger now? Keep going, uh, that way. Oh. I was gonna dodge. Music is really nice. Uh, one of those doors. It's one of those doors. Yep, this is the house. We got a piece of her. Nice. Richard! This is my little Richard. Thank you, thank you. I'll give this to you as a reward. This is my little Richard. Hey, if you had a pet, you'd refer to this that too. Oh. Yeah, like I a penis stroke. <laughs> what a good little boy. Good little dick. Stop! You're gonna get my get this video demonized. Demonized. Stop saying. Why are there so many wild dogs in the city? What kind of town is this? It's called the Marketplace, and has one of the catchiest songs ever in the game. It does. Well, I didn't mean to do that. Hey, your clothes, they're different. You're not from around here, are you? Oh, you're a fairy boy from the forest. <laughs> that sounds racist. <laughs> like a stereotype. My name is Melon. My dad owns Lawnlawn Ranch. And to be fair to uh, Tails Doll, to be fair, that's pretty much all they really know about the Kokiri because it's yeah. because is that they're they're kids and they have fairies flying around. To be fair, I don't think that's a stereotype. It's just referring to them as what they know about them. Dad went to the castle to deliver some milk and he hasn't come back yet. Oh my gosh, it's the origin of the of the joke where the dad's leave to go get the milk. <laughs> <laughs> You're so what? So uh, go. Oh, there's a castle right there. I right go there. I right go right there. I right was about to say. Oh, and this is the, from Smash. This is in Smash Bros. Brawl. I mean, Smash Bros. Old. In Smash Bros. In general, this castle. Mm. The princess is inside the castle just ahead. Be careful not to get caught by the guards. <laughs> so, so I've, I found out something. So you're supposed to sneak into here with the, uh, with the vines. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to sneak in here with the vines, but you can actually bribe that guard to open the gate for you. Mm. But you need to go back. Why? Just do it. All right. Notice how the lady is, the girl is missing. <laughs> Where did she, where did she go? Go back again. What? You're back in your screw in circles. Don't worry. Don't, worry. Don't fall asleep to her. Tasha, don't fall asleep to her. Okay. Are you going to the castle, fairy boy? <laughs> Would you mind finding my dad? He must have fallen asleep somewhere around the castle. What a thing for an adult to do. Tee -hee. Oh yeah, if you look for him, I'll give this to you. I've been incubating this egg very carefully. Hey, y'all. You got a weird egg. <laughs> Feels like there's something moving inside it. <laughs> don't you dare make another joke like that. No. I want to see if I want to see if you could actually bribe him. Yeah, I saw it on YouTube. You could literally bribe him if you talk to him after. Although I think it might also have to be daytime. So, so uh, just go normally. All right. I know it's all they know about them, but I swear, fairy boy sounds like a a slur. Like, hey there, fairy boy. <laughs> so you left your forest, huh? Go back. Go back to where you came. Oh, oh, oh! Before you continue on. Before you continue on. Bonk into that tree. Wait, 
And come on, bonk into it. Burger burn, bonk into it. Roll into it. All right. Oh. Nice. Now I'm going to So we're gonna have to sneak behind some, around some guards. Told you you're awake over there? Barely. I'm so tired. You know, working all those nights. Look, see, that's the castle that's in Smash Bros. Right. The map looks like a sad face with the text cube. <laughs> We're stealing money from the royal family. Oh, this must be the girl's dad. Wait, what? Did I see the chicken? <laughs> What's the chicken? What? Equip it. Uh, Could equip the chicken to fly? Or glide? Nope. Throw it? Walk onto him. And use it. Uh, okay. I saw. <laughs> Hello, and who might you be? Yep, I'm Talon, the owner of Lon Lon Ranch. I went to the castle to deliver some milk, but I sat down here to rest, and I guess I fell asleep. What? Melon was looking for me. I'm gonna catch it from her now. <laughs> I messed up bad, leaving Melon behind to wait for me. She's really gonna let me have it. What the hell? If I just beat a beast by your pet, my turn was bad. This is, this is worse. This is like reverse abuse. And I figured that this, I had to move this. For some reason. You can technically get across here with only one block. But I have not yet figured out how to how to exactly do it because I keep forgetting. And you're gonna be needing to sneak around some more to make sure you don't get caught by the cards. Gotcha. But guess what? You have to wait for daytime because you can't sneak inside the castle till then. So what I like to do is I like to uh um practice my sword and shit. Or just mess around if I have to wait. Here, Joshua. Okay. Since Grandma said you have to sneak around some more, but why don't you just mess around and fool around while we're waiting for daytime? Nuts. No, those are seeds. Don't, don't go there. Don't go there. Oh, the guards. I see. So I'd have to sneak past them somehow? Yep, but you have... No, not through there. But oh, you have it. you have to wait till it's daytime. So I just have to wait then? Yep, I like to fool around with my sword and backflips and such while, while waiting. So what do I have to do? Swim through the water? Nope. Flashbang the guards. <laughs> Don't go! Don't go near. So what am I supposed to do? Go back. You see those blocks that cream.bd stacked? 
Oh, I do have to push him across? I see. No, you don't. Just climb on top of it. And then just jump across. Right. I figured that out. So there's going to be guards, and you have to make sure they're not looking. I will tell you where the... I got it. I will tell you when to move. Can I not hide under the barrels? No. No. Oh, I got this. Oh, no, it's gonna get progressively harder. I got it. That's what it looks like. No, 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 no! Go around, bad boy. Hold on, I got it. Just let me do my thing. I'd like to move from here at the... I got it. You can get those, try and get those rupees without getting caught if you want. I don't try it though. I'd say go now. They're both on one, that one side. You go through that way. Make the gun for it, yeah. Roll, roll. Or no, yeah, roll, 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 roll. I got it. Oh, there's something funny that you can do. So there's two windows on both sides. Don't talk to her. So get that window and then shoot it with a slingshot. Oh, it's inverted controls. Okay. Don't oh. get... No, the other one would probably should give you a rupee. A, t a red rupee. Is that a portrait of Mario? Yeah, basically this original version has a bunch of Mario 64 characters in the background of that. Like, if you were to move the camera out of bounds, you'd see a lot of characters from Mario 64 on the background, on the wall. Yeah? I thought that was a really cool Easter egg. Those are cool. Hey, woman. Go back to the kitchen. <laughs> Who? Who are you? How did you get past the guards? Who are you? Why are you in my room? <laughs> are you flirting with my sister? Oh, what's that? Is that it? A fairy? Then are you are you from the forest? No. Uh -huh. Then then you wouldn't happen to have the spiritual stone of the forest, would you? That green and shining stone? That's so oddly specific. It's it's the thing that you got from the Deku tree. I know, but why does she know that? Because she's supposed to. She's the highly... She's part of the royal family. She's the princess. She's supposed to know what it I is. I get what you're saying. It's just such an odd request right off the bat. Oh, that's true. That's true. That's fair. Suddenly, a ray of light shot out of the clouds, part of the... Out of the forest, part of the clouds, and lit up the ground. The light turned into a figure holding a green and shining stone, followed by a fairy. Oh yeah, she can see her through the through dreams. I know this is. Yes, I thought you might be the one. Did you better go? Hold on, hold on, hold on. I have a joke with this. She said you she might be the one. Um. Um, Billy G. <laughs> That's what I remember, think of every time is the Michael Jackson song Billy G. Who says I am the one. I got carried away with my story and didn't even properly introduce myself. I, I am Zelda, Princess of Hyrule. In bed. <laughs> You've probably seen too much TV in our tales, though. What is your name? 
strange. It sounds somehow familiar. So the fact that she could remember, I mean, honestly, to be fair though, if you could remember, if you hear an unusual name like that, of course you'd remember what it is. Right. Okay then. You ready to get in bed? I'm going to tell you the secret of the sacred realm that has been passed down by the royal family of Hyrule. Please keep this a secret from everyone. <laughs> Come on, don't be a flyer. <laughs> that this looks just exactly like a face a little girl would make, though. Yeah. Uh, I don't make that type of face, and I'm a little girl. I'm Sherman. Sherman. The legend goes like this. <sighs> <laughs> the three goddesses hid the Triforce containing the power of the gods somewhere in Hyrule. They're all just the same with different colors. The power to grab the wish of the one who holds the Triforce in his hands. If someone with a righteous heart makes a wish, it will lead Hyrule to a golden age of prosperity. If someone with an evil mind has his wish granted, the world will become consumed by evil. That is as that is what has been told. So the ancient sages built the Temple of Time to protect the Triforce from evil ones. Well, I'm sure I'm sure to pay attention to this measure. Treasure, didn't Crimdo usually play this for me when I was a little boy? I think so. Yeah, I did. I was wondering when you wanted, either of you was going to notice. That's right, the Temple of Time is the entrance through which you can enter the sicker realm from our world. But the entrance is sealed with a stone wall called the Door of Time. And in order to open the door, it is said that you need to collect three spiritual stones. Another thing you need is the treasure that the royal family keeps along with the legend, the Ocarina of Time. Did you understand well the story I just told you? Do not. I don't know what it means. I, because I think you're, she's going to make you go through the whole thing if you say no. <laughs> and I don't want to. I was spying through this window just now. The other element from my dream, the dark clouds, I believe they symbolize that man in there. Will you look at through the window at him? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. I'm gonna, when I edit, I'm gonna go... This you, fucker. When you, Why is he in the castle? He's pledging his allegiance to the king who's off, who's off screen. Right. That is Ganondorf, the leader of the Gerudos. So it's only set in faith that he's evil. He's not actually evil yet. Based or he hasn't done any wrong yet. Yeah, well, here's the story about the Ganondorf. Well, so we'll find out later. No, 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 no. About the evil thing that you said that he's destined to be evil. Mm. There's a, basically, the very first link in the series, canonically, is Skyward Sword. And he fights this dude named, uh, I think, He's like a demon, uh, I forgot what his name is, but basically he makes a curse where he will always be reincarnated. And he's always reincarnated as Ganondorf or Ganon. Right. I forgot what his name was, I have it at the tip of my tongue. Mm -hmm. So yeah, basically Ganon, that's why they don't kill, they don't, they, after a certain point, they don't kill Ganondorf. Because he'll just be coming back anyways. Right. So they just imprison him. But I can sense that man's evil intentions. What Ganondorf is after must be nothing less than the Triforce of the Sacred Realm. He must have come to the high road to obtain it. Great Bell's face when she's depressed. <laughs> Shut up, Green. That be the... Now, we are the only ones who can protect our own. Please! Oh, <laughs> Aww. Aww. Please believe me. My prophecies have never been wrong. Wow, she's as whitey as cream.bd. Shut up! <laughs> Hi, I am afraid. I have a feeling that man is going to destroy Hyrule. He has such terrifying power. 
Nah. -uh. What do you mean, nah? -uh? <laughs> but it's fortunate that you have come. We must not let Ganondorf get the Triforce. I will protect the Ocarina of Time with my, all my power. He shall not have it. You go find the other two spiritual stones. Let's get the Triforce before Ganondorf does, and then defeat him. One more thing. Take this letter. I'm I'm sure it will be very helpful to you. You, re you receive Zelda's letter. This letter has Princess Zelda's autograph. You could probably skip this by pressing B. I don't know. No. Fuck. Oh, it's already equipped. No, you don't need it. You don't use it yet. Hold oh, it. I have to show it to someone. Yep, and after you can learn this song, we'll end the skin video. Who is that? I am Impa oh, of the Impa. Sheikas. I am responsible for protecting Princess Zelda. Everything is exactly as the princess foretold. Since she is a Sheikah, she's the only one that believes Zelda. Right. Because she actually can tell, too. You are a courageous boy. You're heading... My role in the princess's dream was to teach a melody to the one from the forest. This is an ancient melody passed down by the royal family. Mm. I have played this song for Princess Zelda as a lullaby ever since she was a baby. There is mysterious power in these notes. Now, listen carefully. Tits. <laughs> So you can either use the Y and X button for the two left and right notes, or just use the C stick. Either, whatever feels best for you. Wait, the Y and X button? Yeah, you can see, watch. Oh, my bad. So I got you, it. Yeah, I see what you're saying. Yeah, so, you, but I like, I, you, oh. you, you have to do the up C stick note with this actual C stick. What does X do? Down? Left. Left? C does down. I would just use the C stick. Yeah, but it we feels we but for speed running, when I like speed run this game, like when I try and play, play really fast, yeah. it feels better to do to just do Y X. Mm. Y C stick up X really fast. It's it feels better than just C stick really fast. No no no. We're not speed running, so it's okay. <laughs> yeah, well if you were to try it with the just a C stick really fast, you'd understand why I choose to just swap. You know? I don't know. We'll see. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Ba. You brave lad. We must... Pre She's Scottish. <laughs> you brave lad. Take a good look at that a mountain. Volcano that is died. Death Mountain. Home of the Gorons. They hold the spiritual stone of fire. At the foot of the mountain, you will find my village, Kakarika. This is where I was born and raised. You should talk to some of the villagers there before you go up that mountain. Also, she's a ninja. The song oh, I, I just that. taught you has some mysterious power. Only royal family members are allowed to learn the song. Remember, it will help to prove your connection with the royal family. She needs to be played at spec. Like, at least be a, like a skin. She needs to That'd be... That would be cool. For chic. Yeah, Maybe like... Impa. Yeah, like either imp... Maybe Impa could be a chic uh, Echo Fighter in Smash Bros. That would be cool. So, let's end the video here. Thank you for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. It would mean a lot to us. Rawr. Um, anything you want to say, Charles Star? Uh, thank you for joining us for this playthrough. Yeah. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.